Good afternoon, everyone. This is tongue-tied Zingara Carmella, a comedian Lisa speaking. I hope everyone is well. Um, this reading I've got for you today is uh, again a continuation because I've had quite a few um, continuations of angel readings uh, that that I've, that I've, <laughs> here we go again I'm tongue tied <laughs> that have come out over the last few weeks right this one is a continuation from yesterday's reading um, I can't remember the title of it uh, Life. Archangel Michael Life Infinity I, th I, I do believe that's what they call it there will be a link for you to follow to, to read upon it because each week I I, I do my right my right ups with with my angel read with with my angel readings and I had um, music to go with it for it to be uplifting and to be a positive message to help my audience and those that are watching what I do to help get them uplifted if they're going through a, a bit of a difficult patch with themselves and especially with COVID-19 and hopefully by summer we should be out of the restrictions so here goes I'll probably end up getting tongue-tied, so bear with me. For those that have come along to, to see this reading and it's your first time, um, I'll explain how I do my angel cards. In the reversed position... Sorry, I've got these the wrong way around. In the reverse position, as you can see here, because this one is about good luck, this angel card reading is, is about good luck being on your side. Uh, as you can see, this one, this angel card is a homemade one. And it's about affairs of the affairs of the heart, and it's in the reverse position, whereas this one is in the upright position. So the reversal positions is what I call a negative or a negative situation. I'll say that again because <laughs> I got tongue tied. The first uh, is what I call a negative aspect of yourself or a negative situation surrounding you. The upright. of the angel cards in the upright position is what I call a positive aspect of yourself or a positive situation so here goes I do hope you can understand tongue tied Zingara Carmella <laughs> right <laughs> um, 
Oh, by the way, I do I do do numerology with my angel card readings as well. Um, I find that I, when I use numerology with the angel card readings, I get I, I get more depth with them. So the the relationship card, the effect, the affair of the heart is. Um, what I'm what I, what I'm feeling is that those that are watching maybe those that are, that are watching me and my videos and and are resonating to to what I am saying. In, in in my videos and in my readings, if you've caught caught my readings on Facebook, is that the you feeling at the moment content with yourself, even though this is in a reversal position. Um, you, you more than likely would understand understand it a lot more when you if you go to yesterday's reading with how with how I've done it. There will be a link at the bottom at at the bottom of the video for you to follow, so you can read upon it and then follow today's reading. It's what, like I, like I've been saying, is is, is is you're content with your own faith, your own beliefs, and you starting to reject negative thoughts, feelings. Circum circumstances and feeling as though you are a lot more positive about things that are going on. There is a lot of balancing going on with you with yourself between your heart and your mind because sometimes your mind can take over the heart so to speak so there is there is a balancing out going on there with yourselves but things are moving and on on the up and up they, they really are moving along even though if you if you haven't noticed it with with how you with how you work things out for yourself and done things positively for yourself they are moving along and and changing and it's what you put in the universe with good intentions, you get back tenfold. But it may be with this relationship card is a situation more than likely regarding a partnership maybe it's broken up maybe uh, 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 something has gone off 
and something has gone off behind the scenes that you haven't been able to see and you're trying to put things right with, with, the, with the partnership. But as I was saying with um, this three of Gabriel, here we go, I've got tongue tied again, it's not Gabriel, it's Archangel Raphael. With this three of Raphael, there is um, celebrations coming. You're, you're able to um, be within the community of your friends, as it says at the bottom of the card. There are happy announcements coming regarding relationships or children, but I'm feeling it's a lot more to do with relationships. Uh, there's a happy atmosphere surrounding 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 you with your friendships, your relationships, your partnerships that you that you do have. And here as I was saying which is connected to yesterday's reading is that any negative situation or negative feelings and thoughts you've had about the situation and, uh, and it's come out in a positive way for you, which which this Ten of Michael, because he is round you, he is round you and he is helping and healing you over the situation that's going on in your life. But these... But what I'm trying to say is, go with the flow because everything isn't resolved as yet and it is mentioned in yesterday's reading. So go with the flow, stay positive and everything will resolve itself by the winter months. Because the, the, the answers that you've been searching for and looking for will present themselves as you're going along and going with the flow. So s stay in a positive way with yourself and go with the flow. And if you have been feeling unsure about, this is a positive quote, if you have been feeling a little bit unsure about the decisions that you've been making, don't be. Don't be. Because you, you can re turn this the right way up now. And to know that you have been making the right decisions because you can make good decisions. So I do hope this reading has been of great help to you and has uplifted you in your problem and situation where there is negative outside influences I've got I've got to say it because uh, a lot of it that I picked up on from yesterday's reading it, I, I did pick up on outside influences um, negative 
negative outside influences affecting affecting you where you've been feeling unsure maybe feeling down about certain things that have been going on with the situation that is going on in your life so i do hope this has up uplifted you and thank you for watching my video and i will speak to you next week and good luck because good luck is on your side and michael the archangel is with you and helping and healing you so stay well stay focused stay empowered and i'll be seeing you next week thank you